Go ahead. Uh, all praise to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh. All praise to uh, all praise to Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh. You know, I guess the Lord wanted me to say it twice. <laughs> um, double honors to the elders and apostles of GMS, and um, uh, peace and salutations to all the brothers out there that's teaching the four, uh, teaching on the four corners. The truth and sincerity. All right. But speaking of my brothers, man, man, brothers, man, y'all gotta act brotherly. All right. You can't be acting like niggas towards brothers. That's right. Okay. Right. In GMS or out of GMS, man. If they're teaching this right doctrine, man, you gotta treat them like brothers, all right? That's right. Right. If you can get that for me. Just... Yep. We got, you know, we got, you know, we got dudes, man, treating uh, brothers like niggas, man. Calling them, and I don't even feel like I don't even feel right calling another uh, brother a nigga, man. That even got trouble. That, that even troubles me sometimes. So, I, but I, I don't even avoid it. All right. Call him, call him, that nigga and everything. I don't, I don't like using that word towards another brother. Right. I'm bare. I mean, me and me, but you know, me and my brothers play and everything. You know how I mean, we got we got a lot of respect for each other, man. But some brothers, man, they just man that nigga. Man, I don't trust that nigga. All right, you know. Yeah, it's just it's really because it's how just uh, it, it only means black. But like I yeah. said, you know, you try to you try to um, try to you know refrain from because uh, the word just holds a demeaning characteristics, man. You know what I'm saying from from what uh, America makes it. I mean, like I said, it's not, it's, it's not, people actually get offended, but I mean, I, I ain't really tripping off of that, but I mean, basically, we just want to be brotherly towards our brothers, man, you know, because we, we're to the end of this thing, and basically, man, it's all, it's all about the brotherhood, man, you know, fellowship with the brotherhood, but I, even the fellowship is, 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 I mean, we don't even have time to really fellowship like we want to, man, you know, because this thing is heating up, man, we don't even have, we, we barely got enough time to study with our brothers and, and see them a few minutes, but brothers got to these jobs are being wicked, man. They're keeping us overtime. You know, brothers try to got to work extra hours and shit to make ends meet. You know, it might be a little better now that it's getting warm out here, man. A little bit more work might, might generate. Brothers not to be Titus, what? Eight and what? Three? Uh, no, Titus three and fifteen. Alright, this is uh, Titus three and fifteen. Mm -hmm. uh, he said, and all he said, all they are within this Titus? Yeah. You sure? Titus three and fifteen? Three, no, three, yeah, three and fifteen. Okay, all that are with me mm -hmm. salute thee. All that that's uh that's um uh, I think that's Paul, that's uh Peter. Is that Peter? No, Titus. Yep, uh, uh no, this is Paul. That's Paul. Oh. Somebody's all that's within me. Salute thee. Basically, man, if you, uh, uh, basically, he's kind of saying if you're with, if you're with what he's teaching, all right. If you're with the same doctrine, man, salute. Read it over. He said all that are with me. All that are with me. Uh, salute thee. Salute thee. All right. So basically, if you're, uh, if you're uh, with, if you're fellowship with another guy, man, salute thee. All right. Go ahead. He said, greet them that love us. Uh, greet them that love us. Love what? You love your shot just like we do. All right. Go ahead. In the faith. In the faith, in the faith, all right. That means in the truth. Right. Go ahead, because it says, um, because also it says, um, I believe it's in Timothy, it says, uh, I right. uh, in the faith, uh, grace be with you all. Grace be with you all. Amen. 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 So I think that was plain and simple. Right? They basically, Greek them. They basically didn't have a, a set name on it, all right. It basically says, well, it's basically saying within the faith, all right, within the truth, okay. You can give me Hebrews, I believe that's 10 and 1. Yeah, I'm already there. You can get a Hebrew, yes. Yeah, all right. <laughs> uh, Hebrews 10 and, 10 and 1. He said, uh -huh. For the law, for the law have showed up. Let me see again. He said, For the law having a shadow of good things to come and not a very, and not a show of good things to come and not the very image of things that never with, with those sacrifices. Which they offer by year by year continually, making commerce perfect. Let me read that over. Yeah. He said, For the law having a shadow of the good things to come, and not the very image of things, can never with those sacrifices. Uh, I don't think you're going to read that. Uh, you know what I'm looking for. Just try to find it. God, uh, let's take, let's take this in. Uh, 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 uh. Alright, done. Done. Alright, well, I'm, I'm gonna read this, but I can't say. 
Uh, Cause I mean, with brothers, when you do get with brothers, man, you 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 um you want to assemble together, man. As, as far as you want to uh, fellowship, uh, discuss the scriptures, or you want to fellowship, man, just to discuss, man, at the time are, uh, are wicked on this side, man. We love our brothers, man, because that's all we got in this kingdom, man. I actually don't even deal with the to two third niggas, man. I mean, even though, even when I'm at work, I try to have less dealings with the two third niggas as I possibly can, because I, I already got to put up with them at work. And I gotta, I, 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 uh, I have to do business with them, man, to, to make my money, you know. So you have to deal with them. But when you with your brothers, man, you supposed to, you supposed to cherish that little time that you have with them, man. That's right. I'm gonna read. Uh, this is uh, Hebrews 10 and 25. He said, um, he said, forsake does. He said, not forsaking. I can go up a little more on that. Let me uh. To love and good works. See, to provoke work and to love and good work. What's the good works? Come out here on the highways and byways to preach the downfall in this place, man. That's a good work in the Lord's highs, man. You know, because that's the only thing. That's the only thing that's bringing us together, man. You know, it's it's, it's Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. Before, if we wasn't in this truth, it's no way in the world we would be having fellowship with other brothers, man. Not the way we've been. Not the way we fellowship. We fellowship with brothers, man, all over the world, man. Through through Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah. Y'all was shot through the elders and GMS on down, man. That's how we fellowship. So, man, you, I mean, and this is, this is a, a, a lovely brother. I mean, I was in the with the Chicago brothers one time, and I remember uh, the brother of uh, Marsh had dropped this stack. Matter of fact, he did it twice. He dropped a stack of money, man. And the brother was like, yo, brother, who dropped this money? You know, he knew it was, he uh, reached his pocket. He was like, yeah, that's mine, bro. No hesitation, nothing. His brother picked it up, gave it right back to him. It happened again, and, um, I think we was in uh, New York with the elders, and uh, he dropped some money. He said, I don't know where he got from where we were at, but both times, man, it was no conflict. Like, no brother said, no, that was mine, none, none of that, man. Brother, not because we, we honest amongst our brother, man. You know, because this, this is a beautiful thing. All right? He said, provoking unto love and to good works, not forsaking the assembly of ourselves together as the manner of some is. But exhorting one another, and so much the more as seeing the day approaching. Right, just like I just said, man. We, when we, we get together with brothers, man, we're, we're, we're praising and hastening the day, man, that y'all about shimmy out shot is gonna put an end to our misery over here, man. Cause we doing fucking bad over here, bro. You know, and and that's that's love. It, that's that's even showing love to the two thirds, man. We love them so much, man. We want to see their ass put to death because they ain't shit on this side, man. And before we came to this truth, man, you couldn't trust a motherfucking nigga, man. You know, I could, I could call any brother any time of night, whatever, man. If I'm stranded, if I dipped off, would go get a piece or whatever, man, and, I, and, and, and the, the, me and the bitch get into it or whatever, and, and, and she's not going to take me home, I could call one of the brothers at any time, man. Any time of night, don't matter. I mean, in the world, man, you couldn't call a nigga to do shit. Okay? So, um... Yes, we see the day approaching, because that day is approaching fast. Faster than what we what we think. Alright, 13 and what, son? 13 and 1. Alright, this is uh Hebrews 13 and 1. Let brotherly love continue. Uh-huh. Let brotherly love continue, right? And what's love? You can get read that in um it says in John and love yeah. is um keeping the command, keeping the statutes, laws, and the commandments, alright? All right. So it says let brotherly love continue, right? So that means all y'all, you know, doing uh, uh y'all all loving the Lord, okay? Go ahead. Let brotherly love continue. Be not forgetful to enter to entertain strangers, for thereby some may entertain angels unaware. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so basically, man, if when um, God come up here, man, he, he sees he don't get it, man. Still, still try to make it plain and simple. You, know? you don't know if that guy's an angel or not. All right. Well, we had that. We had that experience. Um, Dubai. Dubai. Uh, this one lady came up. Still a whole camp. A whole camp. It took notes. The whole camp. She was like, Spiritual brother, she attempted to give us money. Yeah. Man, you know, we didn't ask for it, she gave us money. But also, that script is also talking about, man, even in the world, man. I mean, because um, it's no, it's, I mean, and, and that, that's, that goes due to the elders, too, man. 
elders say we, you know, we don't supposed to be out here being no fucking niggas, man. I mean, if somebody come up and you know, ask us what, what, what you teaching, I mean, you know, if we perceive the spirit as a decent spirit and the guy's coming uh, to ask questions or just to listen, man, we don't supposed to you know, deal with him harshly, man. You know, even when we not, even if we're not teaching, man, if we out in the world and somebody just asks, you know, asks a question or whatever, we don't supposed to be no niggas or just harshly deal with the person. You know, the scripture says, man, if it all be possible, man, live peaceable with all men. You know, I mean, shit, I, 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 when I deal with Esau, man, hey, you know, I hate if somebody uh, uh, pop up and take a snapshot, man, but I don't be buddy-buddy with him, but I mean, I have to show a decent conscience, I mean, a, a decent countenance towards him, man. You know, I can't be all, like, niggerish like that, man. I got to be like, hey, how you doing? Uh, yeah, you know, uh, hi, uh, what, what's the problem today? You know, if I'm dealing with him far as, like, I'm approaching him to sell him a tire or fix his car or whatever, whatever the case may be. You know, you're supposed to be showing, you know, show yourself to be a man, man. You know, you can't be a nigga all the time, man. You can't be a nigga no time, not in this truth. What was the answer to that? Yeah, that's basically it. Give me a uh, Proverbs. I love them that love me. that love me. Well, I just said that love would marry you following the commandments, all right? So you can't not follow the commandments and say that you love the Lord, okay? And those that seek me early shall find me. Seek me early, man. I'm so much older. You're, you're a problem with your youth, all right? Because that's why, you know, you um, uh, you go to school while you're young. You don't go to school while you're old and everything because the problem with your youth, man, you absorb a lot, all right? It's from your, from your, when you're born from a baby, you absorb everything that you see. That's why a baby can learn any language. Yeah, any language, any language that a baby can learn it like that. I don't care if you just speak in four or five words and they all mean something totally different, man. You get up, when that baby gets to the age, man, where it start learning to talk and other thing, it's gonna learn exactly the same thing, all right? So a baby, so imagine the same thing as you getting older and you know how to talk, walk, and everything. You know how to do function now. Now, and I, now I get to that point where you, you wanna learn how to uh, uh, cook or learn how to clean and everything, stuff like that. You ain't gonna. You ain't gonna automatically know how to do that stuff, all right? Not yet, you gotta be tough. Yeah. So when you're young, that's when you absorb the most knowledge and everything. You know, oh, all yes, we gotta absorb a lot of stuff. You know, the scriptures say, all right? Because you're gonna, you're gonna not just absorb, you're gonna retain it also. All right? That's why right. an older person is gonna be a little, it's not gonna be impossible, but it's gonna be a little bit harder for them. Right? Right. That's what we got more than people. That's it's like yeah. up the age, like the, the 35s that? and 40s and 50s, all right? with A's, man. He, <laughs> I don't got to get him on the basketball court. <laughs> Listen, um, but yeah, but he's, he's right, though. Uh, that's why the scripture reads, uh, old wine, don't, you can't uh, put old new wine in old bottles, man. Because basically that's saying that, that you can't teach an old, an older person, man, has already been set in his way. The way he's been taught is already what he's stuck with. You know, so basically it's better for him. It's better for teaching a person with a clean slate that really don't go to church. It's not really indoctrinated with church doctrine. It's better to teach that person than a person who's been going to church all their life. Because they're going to come back and they're going to spew up all that bullshit that they've been taught, man. That's just that's the account in uh, Nicodemus, uh, 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 John chapter 4. You know, because he told him, he said, man, he said, you have to, to, to get the kingdom, man, you have to be born again. You know, and it went over Nicodemus' head, man. He didn't understand it, you know? Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I got that for you, too, and uh, John. Oh, uh, love. Oh, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, This is just uh, got the, uh, yeah. what you wanted earlier. This is uh, 2 John uh, 1 and 6. He said, and this is love, that we walk after his commandments. Nah, that's the only type of love, you know, the, the scriptures. You know, if you might, you know, well, really, that's the number one love right there. Yeah? If you do that, you love, all right? If love is not um, having compassion for one another 
you know. It is you know, having it's, compassion. It is having compassion, but you know, if you look up the word, you know, you look up the word love, saying having a uh, lust for one another. Um, uh, uh, what's another? Uh, well, but yeah, feeling each right, other's right, feelings and everything. But really, uh, yeah, because this world's definition of love is all the time. Yeah, right. I mean, if you if if you truly offended somebody, man, niggas get offended over the, the simplest shit nowadays, man. You know that shows that they're not men, man. You know, okay, if you get offended, man, shake that shit off, man. You know, I mean, the neighborhood, man. You know, when I was growing up, man, hell, you fall if you playing basketball, you riding a bike, whatever, you fall, man. Your pops or your your friend may pick you up, man. Shake that shit off, man. Be fucking crying, call you a little punk, man. Yeah. You know, so the same thing with this truth, man. I'm like, okay, you might you might stumble here, man. Get up, shake that shit off, man, and, 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 and continue to do the work, man. Yeah. Hi. Matthew's uh, 12 and uh, 50. Uh, Matthew's 12 and 50. He said, for, for whosoever, for whosoever shall do the will of my father. Read up to uh, 15, read up to 48. 48. He said, but but he answered and said unto him. 47. Uh, then, then one said unto him, Behold, thy mother. He said unto him, Behold, thy mother and thy brethren stand without. So someone came to Yahweh Shah and said, Thy mother and thy brother stand out. Right? Basically, they look at the people out there. Yahweh Shah, where Yahweh Shah? Start being a little deeper in this truth, man. Your family start asking where you at and stuff. Every time, every time we go out to you know, our granddad, our granddad calling us, like, where y'all at? Why, why don't you be out here no more? Like, uh, uh, we got friends. Man, I haven't seen you in a while, man. We got, we just got close for man. We got, we got the same action. Right, man. So that to show you we're not going off. Yeah, how we should be. So that goes back to the brotherhood. Yeah? You're, you're, you're constantly around brothers that's doing it. They, they get, uh, uh, I'm going to get that in, in the pocket for you. You know what I say? The scripture says, man, continues to be around godly men. Yeah, that's why yeah. man is yeah. doing his work, man. In the Proverbs, yeah. it says, uh, 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 if you're with wise men, you should count the wise. Count, uh, he counted his wise. Yeah. Count. Go ahead. All right. He said, but he answered and said to him that told him, Saki, Saki, Saki. Okay, his mother and brother stand without, desiring to speak with thee. But he answered and said unto him, Behold, well, what well, damn, this is scripture. Yeah, that's what I just said. Yeah, that's what I just said. Yeah, that's what I just said. my mother and who is my brother? Right, wait, so you told me to do what you're doing. You told me to do what you're doing. You know, your family looking for you, right? You know, how shall I ask him? like, well, who is my mother and brother? So, you know, you go. I'm going like, to let the scriptures tell me. Right, right. All right, go right. ahead. He said, but uh, he said he stretched out his hand. Well, he said, who is my brother and who is my who is my mother and who is my brother? Right. And he stretched forth his hand. So basically, the Lord answered the question with the question. Uh, all right, uh, go ahead. Yeah. He first stretched forth his hand uh -huh. towards his disciples. Basically, he, he, he like yeah, he, he like presented yeah. them. Yeah, exactly. Presented <laughs> them. Yep. Couldn't say no better. And said, behold, my mother and my brother. Yep. So he says, like he probably was like, see them over there. Behold, my mother and my brother, my, 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 my family, basically. Basically, yeah, and, and, and was that a diss? That yeah, that diss? wasn't a diss. He was basically just letting okay. the guy know. Hey, hey, matter of fact, um, what did he say? Um, uh, 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 hey, when he was a kid, when he got when he got uh -huh. lost, when yep. he got lost, yep. and they came back to look for him. He said, "Why, why, why did you leave me? Why did you?" Uh, I know that I was about my father's business. Yep. So, so this is not a diss. Shout y'all, right. my brother. This is not a diss, man. This is what we this is what we're supposed to be doing. We're supposed to be adhering to the things that's scriptural, man, and spiritual. Because this is what the whole truth is about, man. Now, that's why I so important to be careful with Brotherhood is like almost. 
Central, man. Yeah. I, I love these brothers, man. This brother had boosted my faith up, man, because when we was going to go down to the Paso, he was like, man, I'm going to the Paso. I said, brother, I'm going to work with you. I ain't got no money. And the brother said, man, don't worry about that. And I think the Lord had to work with me with that, man. Because it all about it. was there all from the day we got to it. And I was giving that brother to go down there. We were blessed, man. Starting from that day, man, the brother didn't go get nothing to eat. We was hungry to bug, man. A dude got out of his car with a big bag of uh, Chick Fil A. Chick Fil A, man, wraps. And he's like, "Hey, brother, so I guess he was there to he was there to give it to the homeless." And and, and Spirit had him to give us. He got us home. He gave us two big old wraps, man. We was like, "Damn!" You know, from that day on, all through the trip, everything we was just blessed, man. You know, it was just what we said. That's why we knew it was Spirit, man. And we was amongst brothers. You know, it was this whole spiritual day, man. And that that whole out of the whole trip, being down with the elders, man, this was just a spiritual man, man. Got me a whole take on my whole outlook on the thing, on this, on this truth. Totally different. Everything is spiritual, man. You can only deal with this thing with spirit. That's the whole, that's the whole thing. Said and he said, and he stretched forth his hand towards his disciples as a presentation. Behold, my mother and my brother. For whosoever shall do the will of my father. So, so, so he basically presented his hand. Said, Behold, my mother and my brother. And he turned back to him and said, So whoever do the will of my father, go ahead. which is in heaven, uh -huh. the same is my brother and my sister so, so, and my mother. Yep, so basically, whoever does. Whoever, whoever's in the truth or does the work or anything, anything that pertains to the truth, all right, she's saying is my mother. Hey, all right. So basically, so basically, he, he didn't he didn't separate or he didn't just say basically whoever goes out to do the work, all right? Because we have some guys that's in the truth but doesn't do the work, all right? We got some guys that's in the truth that don't do anything but watch videos, all right? Okay. Does all that right. make them lesser than what we do? All right. Does that mean they're not gonna get a chair in the ride? Does that mean we're gonna be above them? All right. No, it does not. Yeah, because we right. don't. Because basically, we don't know, man. Every man got his lot. Yeah. You know, y'all was shot. I've been working with uh, the brother, the brother's cameraman. You know, it's been kind of just stumbling, stumbling, uh, trying to uh, get get certain things. But you know, the spirit of the Lord is putting the spirit on me. Like, hey, look, you know, uh, just just go slow with him. You know? God. Everybody don't gravitate to it real quick. That's I, right. I, I didn't gravitate to it real quick because I had a problem with my memory. I can't remember the scriptures. I know a lot of scriptures, but I can't like place them. So I might have to write them down a little bit. And and uh, the elders reassured me, hey, look, man, you know, hey, bro, you do what you can do. You know, you do what the, what the, what the Spirit allows you to do, man. Because all this is one body, man. We all, at the end of the day, we all get the same reward. This brother's going to come in this thing at the end, man. And guess what? They get the same reward as we get, man. So it ain't no, it ain't no race. We got the super duper breakdown. We got, we got the, uh, who got the, who got the, uh, who got the, uh, like, who got the breakdown of this? Who got the, uh, uh, what the precept to that? It ain't about that, man. You hold this thing dearly as brothers, man. I mean, it's just like your brothers in the world. When you you don't remember coming up, coming up with your brother, you didn't stop. You didn't. You didn't. Um. You didn't ever. You didn't. You didn't stop. Uh. uh if, if you went, your brother, you and your brother went to the candy store. You went to the candy store. When you got your stuff. You didn't run out back home and leave him. You sat outside and waited for your brother. Because you know, you're going to be good. I mean, hell, anything might happen, man. So you always have to have your, your little brother, your big brother's back. You know, so this thing is just that same. So everybody knows how to be a brother, man. It's just yeah. when you come out of this, come out of this, out of the world, man. You actually be a brother more sincerely, because in the, in the world, what do they say, man? Yeah, that's my fam. That's fam. Hell, you got cousins that act like brother. That's fam. Man, go, go fuck with fam. You know. You got friends that act like brother. Yeah, you got friends yeah. that act like brother. But but it's it's, it's like a falsehood because this world is false. Everything in this shit, everything in this world is, is bullshit, man. You know, so when we came back into this truth, man, it, it, it enlightened us more, so we know more how to be brotherly, man. A brother, a brother, <laughs> I wrote it. I was telling the brother, I said, man, we'll come down there to help the brother fix his house, man. I said, yeah, man, I do roofing, I do all that, man, blah, blah. And the brother said, well, man, brother, I don't know how to do nothing. I can push the broom, though. You know, hey, hey, hey so, so that make him less of a brother? No, man, that's still, you, you love that brother the same, man, because he, hey, that's, if that's all the skill he got, that's cool. I don't care if he just holds it. 
hold a garbage bag while we scoop up the stuff, the garbage and put it there. Every little bit helps, man. Uh, no, uh, that's a that's girl right. saying what they say. Rome wasn't built overnight. Rome wasn't built in <laughs> right, a day. In one day, in a day or something like that. But anything, man, all, all, every little bit helps, man. This, this thing is like a cooperation, man. You how, you how about shimmy out shot? It's built the, the biggest, he has the, he has the biggest cooperation, man. And guess what? This cooperation won't shut down. You know, this thing was like a weld or a machine. So it keeps going. going. All right? Uh, did you get that? Okay, that's it on that trip. You see it on that? Yeah. Matthew. 35. Because this is uh this cuts that uh you know like just gets brothers are coming to this day, man. Uh, 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 I my family. I had to go get my family. You don't supposed to forsake your family, man. But but camp, but camp day, bro. I don't care if your wife gotta take the car and drop you off here, man. You come to camp, man. You take let her get the car. She gonna tend to them kids, man. Hey, 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 it's like, more important than this truth, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing more important than the brotherhood. You know what I'm saying? Right. Everything that's keeping you away. You need, to, you need to cut that shit off and throw it away, man. Like the scripture says, that right arm right of right 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 man. Right. Uh, yeah. Cast, cut it off and cast it away from the body. It's rather right. for your right arm to burn than your, your whole body to burn, man. Because a lot of people got fucking these strangers. Right. 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 You know, whichever one will fit you. That's right. right. Yeah. Hey, you is know? that a thing? I thought I'd been the fuck it out, man. Yeah, you know, nah, man. You know, and it's spiritual. It's not talking about actually cutting your arm off. Right. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's talking about, you know, if there's if it's anything keeping you away from getting, getting uh, 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 submerged in this truth, man, you need to fucking cut it off, man. That's right, yeah. Yeah, That's we have brothers quit playing football, man. That's what we're trying to teach, man. Yeah. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Man, you're yeah. working a medium class job, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, the truth comes first, man. All right. If you have, man, no, the Lord, the Lord put a lot of men in positions to exercise their faith, man. That's right, brother. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got this, you got this shallow ass job, but you know, hey, if it comes, comes Saturday, the motherfucker offer you some extra hours. Hey, I can't take extra hours. Right. I got something to do today. That's right. Yeah. And it's called exercising your faith. Right. That's, 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 that's on point, man, because sometimes you, hey, camp come first. You know, I don't care what bill you got, man. Like, hey, man, look, man, you got, you gonna have to exercise. Hey, hey. You know, how would you feel if you was walking to the, to the, to the like, I'm right, sorry. Right, right. How would you feel if you was walking to the gas station or something, some niggas start chasing you, and you call on them, and how about me outside? He's like, I got something to do today. Yeah, sure. How would you feel? You know, but, hey, but everybody want the Lord to answer right now when they yeah. call on them. But the, when the Lord answered, oh, I got some fucking do. That's what I think. That's why you coming to, you got to look at this thing too. Man. You coming to this thing, man. You got to make life. You got to make life. Bro, you should, you, should, you, should, you, should be, you should be pushing this thing in the world, man. Because, you know, because, man, because if you was in your life, you coming to this thing at that late, late, late age. Guess look how much of your life you fucked off. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You fucked all that off. So now you still come to the you didn't have excuses. That don't make sense, man. You know? Let, let me read that, man. Because that's about the family thing, man. Because, you know, family can actually be a thorn in your thistle, man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah man. Matthew 10, 35. For I am come to set men at variance against his father, and the daughter against her mother, and the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. Wait, 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 uh, against, man. Against. Meaning opp opposite. Against, yeah. Opposition. You know, that means that they're going to come against you. When something comes against you, it's not with you, bro. That's right. Your woman ain't with you, man. Your kids ain't with you, man. Your kids are not even on your own in Esau society, man. They belong to the fucking government, man. That's right, bro. Try not sending them to school, man. See what happens. Yeah. They will come and take your kids, man. Try not giving them their vaccines, man. Your kids don't belong to you, man. You, you, in, in this, in this fucking country, man, fucking America, your, your family don't belong to you, man. You know they, they push that, they push, they push the vibe out for the woman to go cheat. You know, man, it's all kind of TV shows and shit. You know what I'm saying? With women going out, fucking people at the job and shit, man, behind their husbands' back. Yeah. I can think, I can think of that one with the bitch like she's fucking the car. She's this is car right now. <laughs> she, had, she had the cracker son and shit. 
Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that man. ain't no move. Them niggas still giving them money, man. Right, Fuck them with the cash. Man, hey man, that's hey man, that's how they look at you though, man. Yeah, God. But you know what? In, in this society, man, your family not fucking with you, man. Your family is not more important than the truth, man. That's right. That's right. But you know what, man? It's gonna take for the Lord to start killing motherfuckers, bro. Hey, hey, like you say, hey, hey, this brother can contest at the Passover. Yeah. When that wine bottle spilled up, that's right. What, what hey, hey, man, it was a spiritual thing. I, I didn't look at it as, as such, but one of the brothers up behind me, I was moving something. And we was trying to rush out, and the elders like, hey, all right, come on, let's get out of there. So we were grabbing everything, and I'm walking towards the door, and a, but a bottle crashed. And I turned around and looked at it, and the brother I knocked me, and then I was like, oh, shit. He said, man, that's judgment. Boy, it's our killing niggas. And the way that wine, I seen wine fall before. That way that wine rolled all slow like that, man, it looked just like blood, man. And I was like, man, that was spiritual. And all the brothers said, man, come on, come on. Like four or five brothers contested it. So man, the Lord, this is bad. The Lord is not playing no more.